What's up? It's Friday. Oh, you're up there. Hello. Oh, hi. Hello. We're trying something new this week on the Big Foodies. Yeah. Matt, Biggie, <laughs> PV Shea. It's called How to Make the Big Foodies Look Skinnier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Big Foodies presented by Berkey Orthodontics and coming to you live from Biggie's Berkey Orthodontics Kitchen Studio. And uh, we're going breakfast today. We've done a little breakfast before. We've done coffee. We've done hash brown. Hash we've done chicken biscuit. Yeah. Today we're going sausage biscuits. Straight up sausage. Staple of a southern breakfast. Absolutely. The uh, OG of biscuits, in my opinion. Yeah. I feel like yeah. when you have a biscuit, it's the first biscuit you have. Absolutely. It's, a sausage biscuit. Yeah. it's the go-to. We stopped at several different places. We even got one that's a, a sausage croissant. Yeah. Because they don't make biscuits, right? They don't make right? biscuits yeah. there. Yeah, that was the deal. So, yeah. did they yell at you? No, they, they were just like, they just didn't know what I was talking about. <laughs> Did you not read the menu? We've what? never heard of biscuits before. <laughs> Did uh, um, any issue getting these? No, it was very easy. Yeah. yeah. It, was, it was almost weird just getting a sausage biscuit. Yeah. yeah. Three of the four places I ordered it were like, that's all? That's it. Like, that's very it. skeptical. Yeah. Like, that's yeah. all I wanted. But I'm like, yeah, I mean, this is... It's for a podcast. I'm not gonna lie. One of them, I did get an extra biscuit for myself. But, oh, okay. You know, well, is it still in the bag? No, I ate it. Oh, okay, there you go. There you go. All right. Well, uh, um, so we've got the sausage biscuits today from Hardee's, Burger King, Wendy's, McDonald's, Bojangles, Biscuitville, and the Croissant from Sonic. I think we go. I say just start with McDonald's. Mickey I, I would almost bet that even that's probably the first biscuit a lot of people have. Yeah, is yeah. the McDonald's one. The McDonald's sausage biscuit. We've elected BB Shea as all time cutter. Yep. Is a uh, sausage biscuit your uh, go to quick biscuit? Uh, yeah, but see, I like a sausage egg and cheese. Okay. I'm a sausage egg and cheese fan. Love a sausage egg and cheese McGriddle. Um, I'm trying to think of where I would say the like sausage biscuit straight up. No, that's another thing. Do you just eat it like this, or do you put like mustard on it? I've dipped it in ketchup before. I came from a mustard family, man. We put mustard on these. Um, when I was younger, I used to not like the biscuit because it was too much bread. I would order a sausage biscuit and a biscuit. Mm-hmm. And okay. I'd just get a side of sausage. Oh. Huh. I don't know. I usually don't go sausage biscuit. I'm bacon, bacon guy, bacon, egg, and cheese usually. It's but good. If it's around. Also, I think McDonald's biscuits are criminally underrated. I agree. I think it's just because they're most well known. You'll think of them yeah. as the best, but they really are good, uh, soft. soft, very fluffy, soft biscuit. Yeah. yeah. All right. Considering they don't, I mean, do they? They don't pride themselves on making fresh biscuits. No, I don't right? think that. No, it's never been the case. No, I don't think they were. Didn't they have commercials for a while though that were like we make them fresh? I don't know. Maybe. Everyone That's what has I'm a, is, is Every one of them that? has a commercial where there's someone. Somebody's grandma's in there at 4 a.m. baking biscuits. Right. Yeah. So. <laughs> what do you want? Never though. Um, what do you want to go? Or yeah. The king? yeah. Try the king. I. Now you want to talk about price points. Oh, yes, he is. McDonald's. I picked up McDonald's this morning. McDonald's biscuit was right at. Hang on, I still have the receipt for the cheap biscuit. Well, the sausage biscuit used to be the cheap thing, it used yeah. to be like always two for two. You get two biscuits for two bucks. McDonald's with tax was two forty five, but Damn. you can get two, and your second one's a buck. Okay, so that's Burger King, dollar seventy nine. Okay, and I'm gonna be honest, that is a rough looking piece of it sausage. Is. I don't know if anyone can really see how that piece of sausage looks like it's been sitting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. Wow, there, there was no preparation time for this whatsoever. And you know, I like heat lamp food for the most part, but that's uh, that's. And even cutting the biscuits, a yeah, little rough there. Rough. It, oh that, man, that's hard to even yeah, feel that. It's a firm biscuit. That's the thing about Burger King's breakfast is like the biscuits aren't great, mm. the croissants are really good, but I think if the biscuit, oh, God. that's 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 a softer, bad biscuit. Yeah, I think the flavor is there. It's very buttery. Yeah, but man, but it's just a firm biscuit. You're right. That's butter, and that's all I taste is butter. But that's yeah. a that's a bad biscuit. Mm. Not a fan of that. Yeah, sure. I don't hate yeah. just the sausage by itself though. Wow. Yeah. Um, just the sausage by itself wasn't too. Bad. But I will say this: one of my favorite breakfast sandwiches ever is the croissant sandwich. Mm. Bro, the croissants at Burger yeah. are next level. Yeah, they're stupid. But 
It's like, I, I guess maybe the biscuits just, you just don't go there for the no, biscuit. Maybe not. Um, you want to try the new guy? Wendy's? Wendy's it the, is. The newest to the... Uh, I picked up Wendy's. The breakfast world. Do you think it is more or less, and it's the squared sausage. Yeah. It is, okay. To mimic their burger patty. Uh, would you like to guess the price point for the Wendy's sausage biscuit? I'm going to say that after looking at it, I'm going to say a buck fifty. Buck fifty. Now, what was what was Burger King? Dollar seventy nine. Yeah, definitely more sausage. Yeah, I was going to say a buck. It's maybe a dollar ninety nine. One forty six. Wow. Okay. With tax, one forty six. Oh, with tax. Okay. Yeah. Every other biscuit was over two or three dollars. Wow. Their sausage is different. It's like a grilled sausage. And it's more savory than it is anything. Hmm. I'll tell you, for a buck forty six though. Yep. You definitely get a bigger piece of sausage because of the square and the That's overhang. Not bad. That's good. You're right though. I feel like you can definitely feel that taste of being griddled, like cooked on a griddle. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. I think mm. that's the difference. And especially for the price point, that's where I would live. Yeah. Yeah. Hardy's. About the star. Hardy's. The Carl's Jr. Ooh, that's going to be a firm biscuit. Ooh, wow. You know what they used to make that I used to get a lot was the... Uh, Pork chop gravy biscuit. Okay. So they fry a pork chop, put it on a biscuit, and top it with gravy, and then put the biscuit back on oh top. Oh my goodness. So the gravy is almost like a ketchup or mustard would be on the, yeah. on the biscuit. That's something different. I don't think I've ever had that. Don't they put like potato chips on their burgers, like for the 4th of July? Do they? Like hot dogs? I have seen them do a hot dog. Yeah. Hmm. This is gonna sound weird. Definitely a firm biscuit, not great. But I love the taste. Maybe the best tasting biscuit so far. Yeah, so far. It's the it's the um, spiciest sausage, I guess. Mm -hmm. Ooh, fry point. Remember, I got another one. So. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was a little skewed. Sorry. Uh, well, maybe like two ninety nine, maybe. Oh. All right. Hmm. Not the biggest biscuit, but definitely the best tasting. Yeah. I think we've saved these two for last because I always think. Yeah. These two are 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 different. So. Well, before we get into the upper echelon of biscuits, let's talk about the upper echelon of ice cream. Boom. That's the berry patch. Got yeah. your fresh produce. Got your. Uh, did you pick up pimento cheese, Conrad Hinkle? Mm -hmm. Yeah. At the berry patch, which is. And Delicious. Also, going into fall, it's a perfect place to do a little shopping. I mean, candles. You rave about their candles. I, I love their candles. The gift shop itself is just, it, it is the place to go. Actually, yeah. I'm planning a trip to go get a few things down there. There you go. And so, uh, so, so we move into fall much more than just the ice cream, too. I was going to say, stop by. I stock up on their apple butter every year. Mm -hmm. My son, this time of year, loves eating the apple butter on yep. toast for breakfast. So the world's largest strawberry with the Berry Patch, we appreciate you being a sponsor of the Big Foodies. Mm hmm Biscuit Veal. Biscuit Veal. Yeah. Now we know. We love, we've all talked about our love of Biscuit Veal. Biscuit Veal's Biscuit. Oh, that's a good piece of sausage there, too. Biscuit Veal's Biscuit is mine. This is the one where the grandma's in there at 4 o'clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. That is true. Yeah. Go into a Biscuit Veal, you see them making the biscuits. Yeah, mm -hmm. there's like a viewing window. I'll tell you, that's a good piece of sausage on there, too. Good. Now, right thing. This is bill. $3.31 for that Ooh, biscuit. Ooh. Okay. Biscuit bill. So let's <laughs> talk about it. Wow. <laughs> Worth it. I'm sorry. Yeah. Worth I like it. your biscuit bill, but that's pricey. To me... It is a better biscuit, 
but would I rather pay the three thirty one for that or the one forty nine for Wendy's? Yeah. Well, That's, I mean, you know. I think when you move past the sausage biscuit into the other stuff, that's, that's different. where Biscuitville really starts Absolutely. showing its colors. You know what I mean? Sure. Like the bacon's different, the egg's different. Yeah. And I'll tell you, it, it's good, but that's just a lot of, that's that's just a high price plain biscuit. One. Now, I love me some Bojangles biscuits. A gravy biscuit, a sausage biscuit. This one was two thirteen. That's still pricey, but... See, my thing is, I love, I told you I put mustard on them, but I just grew up with sausage biscuits from Bojangles. Again, I think Bojangles used to have them two for a dollar. Yeah. I miss those days. Yeah, now you get the buy one, get one for 99 cents, and you're like, hey, that's a deal, which it still is. It's, there, it's, but it's expensive to be fat. That's <laughs> yeah. yeah. telling me. I think that's probably the thickest piece of sausage we've had. Yeah, I'd say so. Mm. Tastes like my childhood. It says a lot. No, these are what I remember getting with my dad like Sunday mornings on the way to the grocery store. Like, wow. swing through Bojangles and get a couple biscuits. Start day off with a biscuit. I don't know if this is a popular, but I think Bojangles biscuits are better than biscuit bills. Mm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You said something there. Mm-hmm. I think places that do chicken like that do a really good mm-hmm. biscuit. Well, you have to put the biscuits with the chicken, too. Yeah. Hmm. Exactly. So we want to try the croissant? Yeah. yeah. He's an honorable oh. mention, I guess you could say. How much was that? That was like $4. Damn. Yeah, that was stupid expensive. There is a reason, Sonic, that you are an afterthought. Uh-uh. That is it like the other night for no reason at all oh, oh see that's why oh they hit us with the egg and cheese too they didn't just uh, okay sausage. well there we go that's a little extra treat for us i guess but that's still that's four bucks yeah that's crazy sausage egg and cheese croissant you need to take a note from burger king get those burger king will give you uh buy one get one sometimes on those they yeah. do like the double yeah. meat on them yes. well mcdonald's right now does have their um Buy one, get one for a buck. Yeah, that's what yeah, that's mm-hmm. what you get now. Bojangles right now, their deal is the steak biscuit, two for four. Okay. Matt, are you gonna I am partake? I am. I got a big fan of egg. I can take it off. That's fluffy. Yeah. I mean, you know, croissant's just a whole different game. Mm-hmm. I always say this, people think I'm crazy, but the best way to eat a Burger King croissant, which is to take it out and smash it down and get all the air out of the croissant. Let it sit for a few minutes. It's delicious. There's no flavor in the sausage. No. I'll tell you this, that's not worth $4. Nope. Mm -mm. But I think that's the best thing we've tasted. Really? Yeah. I'd pick, I'd pick, I mean, I'd mid-pack that, but I'd put Bojangles, Biscuitville. Are you counting the fact that there's cheese and egg on it? Possibly, yeah. yeah. I mean, I know, I'm, I'm not going to count this with the rest of them because it's an outlier, but I think of all the rest of these, that's the best thing we've tasted. Really? Yeah. What's your top three, BB Shay? Take Sonic out of it. I'm going to put a best of last. I say, I oh know this is Bojangles. I'm going to say Bojangles first. Then McDonald's. Biscuitville. Burger King was dead last. And then Hardee's, these two are kind of like right in the middle. Yeah. I'd almost do the same. I'd put Bojangles. I'd put um, Biscuitville second. And then I'd put McDonald's. Hardy uh, to me, Wendy's wins on price point for... Yeah. But see, they're also doing so much over there. I think a sausage biscuit is an afterthought to them. Mm-hmm. Oh, it, yeah. It's not even yeah. the main thing on the market. Value Little, yeah. Items. Yeah. But still, not a bad deal for a buck fifty. No. I would go um, Biscuitville 1, Bojangles 2. I think 
Hardy's three. Yeah, Hardy's wasn't bad. Wendy's four. McDonald's then Burger King. Yeah, yeah Burger I King. Just, just... Ma- McDonald's biscuit itself, good. Their sausage is the problem. I got yeah. you. I think their sausage is too cased, if that makes sense. Okay, yeah, I got you on when that. You, when you bite into yeah, the yeah, McDonald's yeah. It's, sausage, it's like a, it's too, there's too much casing, casing on, it. on it. Yeah, it's, you feel a firmness to it. Versus the yeah. rest of these that felt like the, you're going straight into the sausage. The rest of them felt like maybe somebody actually made the patty. Pattied out sausage. Yeah. Versus I McDonald's. Like you're going to pop. pop it. Yeah. I got you. That's my All issue right. with that. The rest of them, except Burt. Burger King, yeah, yeah that, that was, that was trash. just. That, that I think was, even Burger King was surprised you ordered that. Yeah. <laughs> like, they, didn't, they probably uh, forgot they had biscuits. Yeah, because they're used to people getting the croissant. Yeah, forty nine. Yeah, that's. Yeah, no thanks. Well, if you've got a go to sausage biscuit, we didn't touch on the fact that you go to a barbecue restaurant. Oh yeah, that's a whole breakfast. different. That's a different. That's a whole different yeah, that's, game. That's a different. Level yeah, right it's there. a different ball game. Yeah, you this like is a country barbecue or barbecue Joe's or yeah. Henry James. Yeah, we used to be if popping you're in the King area. Stratford Barbecue. There you go. That's just me, though, apparently. Barbecue restaurants, it's a different, different. animal. But if yeah. you have a go-to sausage biscuit, I keep, I'm like looking right I know, here. So right you still look yeah, right there. I keep if looking there. If you have there, a go-to like, oh. sausage biscuit, let us know in the comments. If you one of these and you think we got the list right or wrong, let us, let know. us know as well. And let us know what you think about this new camera angle because <laughs> it may okay not stay this now. way. If we film multiple <laughs> episodes today, we might have some crits in our neck. We'll have to let you know. I told you to fix it. <laughs> Check us out on bigfoodiespod.com. As always, thank you to the Berry Patch. Thank you for Berkey Orthodontics for presenting us and sponsoring the studio. BB Shea, Biggie, I am Matt, and we will see you next week.